Hi YouTubers and beautiful people. So I am here as I promised that I will estimate the plot of Bahubali movie. So before you go any further, I request you to watch my previous video. Uh, the link for that my previous video is in the description below. So when Rajmuli asked the question, why Katappa kill Bahubali? He simply said to those people that it is very difficult to answer the question in one line or one word. So that is the reason I try to estimate the whole plot of the movie. So my approach towards estimation is like solving a jigsaw puzzle. So I am taking all those pieces from the trailers and the interviews given by the makers. And all those missing pieces of that puzzle is a part of our imagination. So the whole point of the video is not to estimate the correct plot of the movie, but to have fun. So let's dive into it. I think the movie will start with a narration by Kattappa or Devasena to Bahubali's son. I think it will be Devasena as she will play a major role in the second part of the movie. In the flashback we have intro of Bahubali on Elephant. Sahore Bahubali song will take place here. Then Bahubali is asked to go to the Kuntula Kingdom by Shivagami. Either it is related to the diplomatic relations or looking for a bride for his brother. I think it is the second one. Because Baladeva being the eldest son, Shivagami might have sent Bahubali to arrange a marriage with Devasena as Devasena is the queen of uh, the Kuntula Kingdom. Then we have intro of Devasena the sword fighting scene from the trailer uh, I think at this point he doesn't realize that she is Devasena and he fell for her the interaction led to closeness and they fall in love a romantic song between Bahubali and Devasena takes place Hamsa Nava song then Bahubali left her went to Mahishmati voluntarily or I think it is because of the guilt feeling as she could possibly his brother's bride. Devasena is back to Mahishmati looking for Bahubali. A big family movement takes place as mentioned by Rajmoli. We shot one scene where we had all the characters. Right. Ramakrishna, Satyaraj, Nazar, Prabhas, Rana, Sweetie, Ev uh, Tam uh, Anushka Sethi. Mm. Everyone uh, were there and we were shooting one uh, very emotional scene which comes in the second, second part. Half. Uh, a second part and uh, uh I think it's very difficult to break the human drama but the outcome of this event is Bahubali has to leave the kingdom Bahubali and Devasena started living happily in Kutula kingdom until before we proceed any further into this video I would like to tell that this poster and all these scenes are interrelated to each other because both Bahubali and Devasena are wearing the same dress so this means this event happened on the same day. From this poster we can refer that there is a romantic moment between Bahubali and Devasena. Kattapai is at the kingdom to talk with Bahubali and I think he informs him that both Bijala Deva and Balala Deva are planning a conspiracy against you. Fire surrounds the kingdom. Uh, Bahubali is running on a dam like structure and he is holding equipment on his hand. I think he is planning to release water from this uh, dam like structure so that it can put off the fire. And Bahubali saves the day. And Bahubali went to give warning to Balala Deva. He informs him that I know it was you who put that fire. Uh, you better not repeat this thing or else I won't be gentle next time. And he left. Bahubali comes to know about the war between Kalkes and Mahishmati. Uh, and there is going to be a war between those two people because. So, from the reference of a making video of Bahubali. There is a war formation and we are seeing a labeling as KK Army and MK Army. I am suspecting KK Army means Kalke Army and MK Army means Mahishmati Kingdom Army. Uh, now the number of soldiers is different from what we have seen in the first movie. Now uh, 
and the formation of the soldiers is also different and at the same time the uh, devsen also gets pregnant so bahubali either took devsen along with him to mahishmati or he left her uh, in the kundala kingdom i think he left her back while well, bahubali is getting ready for the war uh, by this time kattapa already got the instructions uh, to kill bahubali so he goes and talks with bahubali and asks him not to go to the war as it is very dangerous to which bahubali responds nuvuna pakkana nanta varaku nannu champe magadi inka puttaledu mama anushka gave birth to a child and she is singing the song kanna nithurinchara which is a song that sung by a mother in order to put his child to sleep So in the absence of Bahubali, a part of the Ballala Dev army attacks the kingdom. There is Eno with child somehow escapes and reaches Mahishmati with boat. Whole Kuntala kingdom is destroyed. Coming to the battlefield, just like in previous war, Bahubali saves the kingdom from Kalakyas. In the moment of pre-climax of the war, Kattappa stabs Bahubali. And I believe we have reached a safe point where now we can discuss why Kattappa killed Bahubali. Now the question is who and why? Who ordered Kattappa to kill Bahubali and why? So let me drop the beans. I think Shivagami asked Kattappa to kill Bahubali. So let me tell you why I think so. Now let's think about the loyalty of the Kattappa. We are completely misguided with the fact that Kattappa is loyal to the throne. In the trailer shot he is attacking a Mahishmati soldier and he is wearing a horse symbol which means he is fighting against Balala Deva. So if he is loyal to the throne why he switch side to fight with, along with Shiva? And when he suppressed the rebellion against the kingdom as per the orders from Shivagami remember that shivagami is not seated on the throne she is not the ruler so it proves that kattappa uh, loyalty is towards shivagami not towards throne and to support the fact that shivagami has ordered the killing of bahubali you remember shivagami asks for forgiveness from the god for all her sin and in the trailer shot it is the shivagami hand and she is apologizing to devasena by touching her feet and how i know it is shivagami's hand from the bangles ring and blood on her hand as it is very similar to the trailer shot uh, jewelry she wore now next big question why why shivagami asked kattappa to kill bahubali we have to remember that shivagami loves kingdom more than her children when an exiled prince that is bahubali getting more popularity than the king then it is very dangerous to the kingdom this possible division in the kingdom may lead to the downfall of mahishmati so she might have taken the decision to kill bahubali now think about the following idea what if kattappa only stabs bahubali not killing him see this following interview of vijendra prasad the writer of bahubali movie కట్టప్ప బాహుబలిని ఎందుకు చంపాడు అది నాకు కూడా ప్రశ్న దానికి సమాధానం చెప్పగలుగుతారా చంపాడని మీరు ఎందుకు అనుకుంటున్నారు పొడిచాడు అండి పొడిచాడు ఓ పడవటం మీరు చూశారు అవును సింహాద్రిలో కూడా పొడిచింది కదా అమ్మాయి చచ్చిపోయాడు ఎన్టీఆర్ ఓకే బతుకున్నాడు అనేది చెప్పడం లేదంటే చచ్చిపోయాడని మీరు ఎందుకు అనుకుంటున్నారు అంటున్నాను అంతే సో వాట్ విజేంద్ర ప్రసాద్ ఈజ్ బేసిక్లీ సేయింగ్ ఈజ్ వై ఎవ్రీ వన్ ఈజ్ ఎజ్యూమింగ్ దాట్ కట్టప్ప కిల్ బాహుబలి all we know is that katappa stabs bahubali it, there is no reference in the movie where it says katappa kill bahubali and for the fact we know that balala deva says this to devasena main taaki ek baar aur use apne haathon se maar pao so i strongly believe that katappa only stabs bahubali and balala deva kills him Now coming to Shivagami we know for a fact that she saves the ch- child 
So what changed her mind? So remember when the trailer starts with the dialogue of Bahubali saying, "Prana tyaga ni kai na venu kada bona ni." రాజమాత శివగామి దేవి సాక్షిగా ప్రమాణం చేస్తున్నాను ఐఎమ్ రెడీ టు సాక్రిఫై మై సెల్ఫ్ ఫర్ ద కింగ్డమ్ సో ఐ థింక్ బాహుబలి న్యూ హీ వాజ్ గోయింగ్ టు గెట్ కిల్ బట్ ఫర్ ద సేఫ్టీ ఆఫ్ ద పీపుల్ అండ్ మహిష్మతి బాహుబలి వెంట్ ఫర్ ద వార్ ఐ థింక్ దిస్ సాక్రిఫైస్ ఇమోషన్ లెడ్ టు ద చేంజ్ ఆఫ్ శివగామిస్ మైండ్ ఆఫ్టర్ ద బ్యాటిల్ బలాదేవ స్టార్ట్స్ సీజింగ్ ఆల్ పీపుల్ లాయల్ టు ద బాహుబలి Balala Deva now wants to kill Bahubali's son as he could be a possible threat to his throne. Meanwhile, Kattapa put child leg on his head. Shivagami apologized to Devasena and then Shivagami brings the child outside and introduced to the people. And she promised to the people that one day he will be back to take back his throne. Shivagami escapes with the child while Dandalaya song is playing in the background. Dandalaya Dandalaya Vatonenu Undalaya And now people who helped Shivagami to escape might be the people who are getting punished here. and then shivagami reaches to the waterfall and rest we know cutting back to present shivudu decides to take back his throne from his uncle aslam khan helps shivudu with army equipment as aslam owes to kattappa oka pranam song is playing while they were preparing for war Shivudu army attacks Mahishmati city. Final battle between Shivudu versus Bhallala Deva. At the end Shivudu defeats Bhallala Deva and puts him on the death bed prepared by his mother. Uh, Devasena lets fire on him and take back her revenge. <laughs> <laughs> 